Hi YouTube, Coin Picker here. These are my yard sale finds for the last month or so. Didn't go to too many yard sales, and there weren't that many good uh, pickings, but was able to find this interesting little uh, cartoon character toy, and it's vintage, probably from the late 60s, early 70s. And you look here, it's uh, made in Hong Kong which uh, is a former British colony but back then it was still a British colony and uh, you know these days what is not made in China so definitely has some age to it got it for 50 cents that doesn't break the bank and um, I think it's probably worth like five to ten dollars and then next went to another yard sale and got this uh, interesting carved Japanese coin box and if you notice they use marquetry basically veneers of um, different woods to make up the colors and that's Mount Fuji pretty neat and um, there was no prices it was a bunch of uh, college students selling a whole bunch of used clothing textbooks you know knickknacks jewelry Checked out the jewelry, you know, nothing to write home about, all junk jewelry. And they were asking, it was on the same table as the jewelry, and they were asking 25 cents for the each pair of earrings. And so I offered them 25 cents for this box. And it's sort of like one of those puzzle boxes. Originally, it wasn't working. If you notice, it's spring-loaded, but it was missing the pin. So I just cut a piece off of a paper clip, you know, but an inch or so threw it in there and it works fine now but uh, it's interesting the the woodworkers they um, to make sure they fit property properly uh, they marked this one with uh, the uh, kanji or Chinese character for number 12 and it matches the marking right here number 12 10 and a 2 it's almost like Roman numerals and on the back side let's see oh it says in katakana or japanese alphabet um mani fu so usually when it's in this script it's to represent borrowed words from different languages like english so right away you know it's mani something to do with money Fu, I'm not too sure what it means in this context, but I'm assuming assuming that it means some sort of a money box or coin box. So for 25 cents, I think it's pretty good bargain. Uh, I would say, you know, it's vintage, probably from the 60s. Um, maybe even the late 50s I'm not too sure but I would say probably worth about $20 you know fair estimate well anyways I hope you enjoyed these finds please rate comment and subscribe coin picker out